Hello, and welcome back to Cardano Coin, where we bring you the most recent and intriguing ADA news. We're giving away 1000 ADA to those who are watching. All you have to do is upvote, subscribe, comment Cardano is king and watch the video to the end to be eligible. The winners will be picked next month and publicized on the community page of the channel. What has historically been referred to as an industry-wide roller coaster year? What can we expect in 2023? Many Cardano ADA investors are unsure whether this turbulent year will repeat again in the upcoming year or if something unique will happen. So let's satisfy our curiosity as worries loom over the market in the wake of the abrupt failure of the major exchanges, as Bitcoin, Ethereum, and Cardano prices have fluctuated dramatically, and as investors face an even more uncertain future. Since reaching an all-time high of around $70,000 per Bitcoin late last year, the price of Bitcoin has fallen by roughly 70%, and the price of Ether has experienced a comparable dip. Cardano ADA is also not an exception, as it is expected to move sharply from its record high of $3.10. Despite these unpleasant possibilities, bullish cryptocurrency predictions are emerging for the coming year. A fund manager at the massive investment company Van Eck has predicted that the price of Bitcoin might increase to almost $30,000 per Bitcoin next year, even as leaks show that crypto CEOs are preparing for a $65 billion earthquake. The first quarter of 2023 would see a test of the $10,000 to $12,000 level for Bitcoin. The crypto winter would be at its lowest point when a wave of minor bankruptcies peaks, he predicted. Bitcoin prices, however, later forecast the rise as a result of a reduced inflation rate reducing energy concerns and a potential ceasefire in Ukraine, as well as a turnaround in supplies, which would launch a new bull market. If these predictions come true, the Fed will probably hold off on raising rates despite a slowdown in inflation while continuing to print money and run budget deficits. According to the fund manager Matthew Skill, the aforesaid situation might result in the price of Bitcoin climbing a wall of anxiety back to $30,000 with just a lack of unfavorable crypto-specific news. Of course, this time with confidence for 2022. As the year comes to an end, many investors are eager to move past what has been viewed as a disastrous year for the whole industry. After cryptocurrency prices skyrocketed in 2021, the fund manager's forecast for the price of Bitcoin should give investors hope for the upcoming year. By November 2021, the market as a whole will be valued at close to $3 trillion. The markets have lost more than two-thirds of their value this year as a result of a spate of blow-ups that have shown how hazardous the business actually is. The Federal Reserve has hinted that it may slow down the rate at which it raises rates in the future, which might be good news for all risky assets. Therefore, a recovery in cryptocurrency should occur in 2023. As the oldest and most valuable cryptocurrency with a market worth of $330 billion, Bitcoin will unquestionably lead the movement. Both individual and institutional investors' first exposure to the asset class is probably through Bitcoin. The money that has left the market this year is waiting for things to change, and new investors who don't have any cryptocurrency positions might switch to Bitcoin in a recovering market. Of course, this action is subject to changes in central bank policy and public opinion on digital assets. However, Bitcoin will be among the first to climb when the market bottoms and prices begin to peak. If all goes well, Cardano, the most popular cryptocurrency, will be easily addressed. ADA will set new records. The Cardano ecosystem is now working on a particular project where their results could spur exceptional performance. Ada Will, who has committed the Cardano sin with her Twitter account, made an astounding prediction for Cardano in 2023. The age of the volunteer, which will usher in governance and decentralized decision-making, is gradually entering the core of a network. 2023 will be a year of governance for Cardano, claims ADA Whale. And what's exciting about this is how the situation will change. He said that Cardano has genuine promise that will manifest. The tweet stated that 2023 would be Cardano's year of governance. That's fascinating because, in markets like DeFi, we will largely be playing catch-up to the other chains in 2020 through 2022. As a result, by letting them dictate the story and following their lead, the tables will eventually flip. 
the launch of the GID stablecoin Cardano, which was created in partnership with the Cadi network, is expected to make the coming year exciting for Cardano. The USDA, a new US dollar-backed stablecoin, is expected to be released in 2023, according to the Cardano blockchain's official commercial arm and founding body. Cardano also introduced his future tokens, Dust and Midnight, a sidechain based on zero-knowledge data protection, a month ago. If all shortcomings are fixed, this project will unquestionably produce great outcomes. According to reports, the privacy-focused blockchain method was criticized by Midnight, alleging that it had a backdoor as an address and tweets that have since been removed from his official Twitter page. If you want to utilize a privacy blockchain with a backdoor, use Monero. If you want true privacy without gimmicks, use Input Output HK, Monero told us at midnight. It further stated that this town deserved to lose if Monero fell victim to this crap. The blockchain also criticized Charles Hoskinson, the creator of Cardano, for using the term backdoor to describe Midnight's blockchain. What's its source? A claim citing the Cardano creator is saying the system will balance protecting privacy with giving auditors and regulators a backdoor into the system when permission is granted came from the source of the misunderstanding. Hoskinson addressed the backdoor in response to the user's question and the allegations made by Monero's. There isn't a backdoor here. He further clarified that the use of the word backdoor was inaccurate and explained what the midnight effort was all about. It is an identity platform for confidentiality that was constructed using the Atala Prism. You add voluntary disclosure as a feature for builders to use. View keys are handled at the DAP level, not the protocol level. At the end of the day, questions about founder Sam Beckman Fry purportedly having a hidden backdoor to transfer billions of dollars were raised by the newly created word backdoor in the wake of the FTX collapse. Negative tweets sent out at midnight, including the founder of Cardano's comments, have now been deleted. However, a few Cardano users have criticized Arrow for drawing rash conclusions based on a third-party report. I would hope that Monero has at least taken the time to read over at least a few of the 18 privacy-related research documents created by various university professors over the past couple of years, since the only tweet that was visible on this page was a response to a discussion started by Rick McCracken, a Cardano stake pool operator, on the research that supports the Midnight blockchain. When we agree that research articles frequently merely outline potential implementations rather than providing extremely detailed financing implementation, we call this a consensus. Additionally, it was probable that none of the reported privacy backdoors were used in the implementation. Moving forward, a number of projects that have been waiting for the creation of the ship hard fork will have the chance to debut in 2023. It houses projects on the Cardano blockchain that are in various stages of development. Notably, during the Shelley era, a community-run staking pool was used to introduce a delegation and incentive program, ushering in Cardano as decentralization. This era laid the groundwork for a decentralized, functional network that ultimately gave rise to the voluntary era. As the Cardano network moves closer to this new era, the first CIP suggests a mechanism for on-chain governance that will assist Cardano's volunteer phase and build upon the first Cardano governance architecture. Charles Hoskinson has shared the first CIP to implement the plan for volunteer governance on Twitter and plans to start with a beneficial and doable first step. Later suggestions would broaden and modify the concept to fit shifting governance requirements. The CLP also suggests a constitution for Cardano. There is no clearly defined document where these guiding principles are recorded, despite the fact that many members of the community and the Cardano founding institutions share a generally universal perspective. It is typical to use the Cardano blockchain to keep the Cardano constitution and the project's ethos alive forever. The present Basho phase, which is heavily focused on enhancing the performance of the underlying networks, is thought of as a successor to the voluntary age. All of this is fantastic information, and in 2023, more intriguing information will be added. While we anticipated that crypto assets would keep setting new records this year, unfavorable macroeconomic factors have pointed to severe losses for crypto investors. This year has defied the predictions of numerous industry experts. Every Bitcoin acquisition made in 2021 will result in a loss, 
as seasoned trader Paul Brent verified in October. From an upbeat perspective, the current market circumstances also give a chance for investors to purchase crypto assets linked to potential ventures at a discount. In 2023, the Cardano network plans to make a significant move. The cost of its tokens is now less than $1. Cardano has undergone significant modifications that may not have been factored in because of the macroeconomic environment. The founder of Cardano also emphasized that there are still plenty of cards left in the game and that a sea of red does not represent Cardano or Donald's power. Of course, what do you think about this? Let's discuss this in the section below. In the following video, we'll see you. Check out our previous movies to see how Cardano is living up to the promise of being the Ethereum killer in the interim. Be careful to always click the subscribe and notification buttons.